<laughs> I smacked a fish. <laughs> I just walked up. Hello, everybody, and ooh, treat. Nice. Welcome back to Raft Survival. In the previous episode, uh, we kind of got a whole bunch of good stuff set up. Uh, we widened out the raft a little bit. I got a cobble generator up and working. Uh, we got there to the exchange store thing. The exchange store thing. And, you know, generally, pretty good episode. Uh, this one, I think it's time to get crazy. Uh, this episode, I plan on starting an underground mining operation. So what we're going to do is we're going to try to safely-ish get to the bottom of the ocean here and close ourselves in a little cobblestone bubble and, well, hopefully not die while doing so. I think I have everything I need. I want to aim down there. So I already started digging down there before I was assaulted by uh, the drowned. I don't remember where it was exactly, though, but we did do something. I do want my dirt block here. This dirt block is kind of like my emergency place down sugarcane. Because uh, sugarcane will make a breathable area. Don't ask me how Minecraft physics work. I don't pretend to understand how any of this works. But we're going to uh, just go for it. So the plan, get down to the bottom as fast as possible. There will be drowned. And my goal... Oh, there we go. Perfect. Come on, don't stop on me. Nope. Now build up around us. At least can't be assaulted. Oh, I can hear them out there, too. Come on. Oh no, I can't see myself in. Alright. Well, that was terrifying, but I am kind of sealed in. Shit. Oh wait, no, that worked! Alright. So I'm kind of sealed in right now. Let's get rid of some of these, uh, Try and get rid of some of these source blocks of water. That's not going to work here. Alright. So now I am... Kind of sealed in, actually. Chink. Throw that down there real quick. Okay. So now I want a door. Can I throw a door here? All right. Well, it's horrible. It's awful. It's ugly. It's if my personality was a Minecraft build, but you know what? It's home. I kind of want to expand this out just a little bit so I have some semblance of breathing room. Where's my sugar cane? There it is. This is just going to be... So this right here is going to be an absolutely painstaking process to sort of expand this out. Ooh. That would be a drowned. Well, it's ugly, but... Well, it's ugly, but it's home. I would like to be able to enter into the... Well, I would, for one, like this space to be a bit bigger, but I guess 
Beggars can't be choosers. And I wish I had access to a sponge right about now. You know what? Overall, I'm kind of pleased with this. It is one thing that I will do here, and that is stack up a sugar cane there, so when I get to the front door... Yeah, no. No, we're not going out there anymore. Now I have access to as much sand I could possibly want. You know what? I think that's just beautiful. So I know once I... How much sand did I already get? Turn that into uh, sandstone. We've hit the mother load, boys! <laughs> Hell yeah! <laughs> I've never been so happy to see dirt before in my entire life. It's so beautiful. Oh wait, I uh just dug there. Eh. Let's do something kind of fun here. <laughs> oh, I love that trick. Nice, so now that I have access to dirt, uh, this game just suddenly got a lot easier. And on the bright side, I didn't have to put forth too much effort to... Ooh! To get to this point. Um, I'm not saying that... Putting forth effort is a bad thing. Uh, I'm not saying that putting forth very little effort is a bad thing, but, you know, in a survival map, every second counts. Oh, look at all this dirt. I'm going to get as much dirt here as this shovel will allow me to get. And I don't think... I think I need a lot of sand, really. Um, as of right now, not a whole bunch of sand. And then I'm going to pick up a whole bunch of cobblestone. Oh, I'm just so happy this is working. I don't have to worry about no drown. I don't have to worry about no water. Oh, just everything's coming up Millhouse. Is it just me or does that seem just a little loud? Let me... Turn that down a little bit. So anyways, I was... Uh, oh, so let's talk about YouTube stuff, actually. I'm, I'm super excited to, like... So I'm uh, so I'm kind of in a lull right now as far as, like, YouTube content goes. Uh, I'm waiting on some maps to come out. I'm waiting on a map to come out. So I'm kind of doing this little bit of uh, this survival series to fill in the gaps while I... Uh... Oh, there's my torches. Kind of fill in the gaps while I wait for more content to get uh, released out. But I'm super excited for stuff to get released. Um, the next adventure map for Mix coming out pretty soon. Super stoked for that. Like, you have no idea how excited I am for that to be released. Uh, that next adventure map is going to be awesome. I say it's next for adventure map. It's really a re-release of Diamond Sword RPG, but with, like, some more stuff. Bringing it up to... Not like a 2.0, oh, but maybe like a 1.6 or something. I don't know. But that's pretty exciting. Oh, this is so much nicer than using the cobblestone generator. So we have a underground mining base. Or we have a... So we have a sub-nautica. Or a sub-water mining base. And that's swell. Unfortunately, I can't like switch into creative on this map. So I can't take like a super good screenshot of this. I'm going to try, but 
I heard a, I think I heard a drowned there. I don't know if you guys picked that up or not, but I definitely heard a drowned. Ooh, that reminds me. I need to get a mob farm. No, first things first. I need to get animals up and running. Actually, what I'm going to use a bunch of this dirt for. Um, yeah, how much dirt did I pick up? Ooh, look at all them stacks of dirt. And I still got durability left in my shovel. This just this little mining expedition here, just setting up this little underground, underwater Minecraft outpost has set me so far ahead of the curve of where I would... has just set me so far ahead of the curve. Um, a little risky, admittedly, and a few heart palpitations here and there still from that little adventure, but that just set us so far ahead. So much dirt, so much sand. I don't know what I'm going to use the sand for, but I have the option. Oh, that's it for... Hobble. Let's pick up a little bit more dirt. I'll basically run out this shovel on durability, and then we'll go back up to the surface. What the... What the hell is that? I don't like that, whatever that is. Oh, let's just kind of dig this way a little bit. In the future, I would like a safer way of getting down here than just swimming and praying, but... Honestly, it, Oh, and that's the end of the shovel. So let's light that up. Alright, let's eat for good measure. Okay, there we go. And up we go! <laughs> I smacked a fish! <laughs> I just walked up. Oh, that's why I stopped swimming there for a second. Come on. Oh! Oh! I just barely made it there. Let me uh, quick pick up Walter Reed there. Walter Reed. <laughs> did I ever tell you guys that I'm hilarious? If I didn't, you should be very well aware of that by now. Okay, so sand, dirt, and cobble just suddenly became infinite resources for us. Um, just a little uh, harrowing expedition. Not have... Grass block, no wheat, burger cane, pumpkins, <laughs> no grass block. What that is over there? All right, first things first. Let's set up. What's gonna look nice? You know what? Grab the logs, convert them. Perfect. Set up. Don't need stuff to look super nice right now. We can worry about functional functionality first, looking nice later. So if I do one, two, two, three, four, so that's seven, three, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, then one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now the only now I need to go grab your mom. And the hoe, your, your mom. It, yeah, it's it's supposed to be it's it's was supposed to be funny, but it, I guess it kind of wasn't. And I didn't put a tree back up here. That's another thing I need. More wood. More wood. More tree. Seeds. I'm gonna experiment with something here real quick. Nope, it only works on grass.
Nice. So I guess that's that farm taken care of. Uh, something else I'd like to do. Maybe kind of along here. Something like one, two, three. One, two, three. I think this is going to work. Oh, it's just a single melon seed. Well, let's convert over three of these. Actually, I can convert over 12 of these. I can do a lot of stuff. But on this side of the farm, I want to do one, two, three, four, five. I can convert 12 of these. So that's one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven, twelve. Da, 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 da. That'll grow the melon, and then one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and then just something on the back side of it to I'm gonna run a test here. I'm curious if this will grow on wood. If like pumpkins will grow pumpkins and melons and stuff will grow on wood. There's only one way to safely do that. Okay, farms set up. And then anything else? Do I need to make more reeds? For the time being, no. I won't. I'll just... Well, what's it honestly going to hurt to just set up a few of these? Three. Three. All right, I finally feel like we're kind of thriving here a little bit now. The... everything's growing pretty quick. That's good. So let's figure out what that is. Uh, this one, I think. Yeah, we'll just uh, kind of build off of here. Man, look at us go. Uh, we've already built an underwater base. We've already got a crop farm growing. Now we're about to figure out what the hell this thing is. If it even is anything. Almost there. hell? Oh. Oh. It's a shop. Looks like some stuff fell. Uh. Fuck. Coal block, place hay bale, place sand, place coal place sand. Coal. Coal block truck. Okay, so it's a, it's a multi-shop. Look at all that. Place oak log. That's pretty sweet. I wonder where we are. Ooh, look at all the... So this is a whole other shop that we can go to what that is up there. Might have to investigate that in the future. All right, so we unlocked the other shops. So it is possible to go to the nether, from what I understand, from what I'm seeing there. So maybe the end goal of the series is to just... Oh, I'm sorry, not to go to... Is to kill the end dra ender dragon. 
So with some creative... With some creativity, make a hay bale. Let me expand the other uh, raft here a little bit, give myself some building room. Yeah, how the hell do you make a hay bale? I wonder if that's something made out of... Uh, Hay bale, hay bale. Anything for hay bale? Bale? I don't understand this crafting thing at all. All right, so that's something to look into for next time. Is this already harvestable? I think so. And it was! Nice! Look at us go here, thriving, surviving, and shit. Look at us go. Look at us. And who would have thunk? Not me, man. Oh, a hay bale is nine wheat. Interesting. Interesting. That's why he wants to, to set up an auto wheat farm. I'm going to have to look up how to do that. Uh, set up an auto wheat farm. An auto wheat farm. You do that without redstone and sticky pistons. So back in the day, I used to... Way back in the day. So when I first started Minecrafting... Minecrafting. I'm talking about it as Minecrafting. I'm I'm at, I'm I'm talking about it as if it's a as it's as if it's a well when when I first started playing Minecraft, I was obsessed with farms, trying to figure out like the best way to optimize farms, like big industrial industrial uh, big industrial farms, and uh, oh shit, this was years ago, like back when I was part of the. Uh, Two girls, one Minecraft community. Uh, I, I think the community has long since... Uh, well, the Minecraft community behind it has long since uh, segmented, but uh, a lot of us, including one of my... Uh, a couple of my good buddies, uh, Brian and Juana, they're listening. They were harassing me the other day because they're like... As I said in, a, in an episode, oh, I gotta go play Civ with some of my buddies. And they're like, that was us! We're your buddies! Like, well... They'll let it go to your head, but sure. So they were actually a part of the... Ryan was. I don't think Juana was. But uh, cool people. So I still hang out with a lot of them. Or I still hang out with them, you know, damn near 10 years after meeting. Sugar cane. Gotta get that cane, sugar man. Gotta get that fix, man. Gotta get that sugar. <gasps> A melon. Nice. Eat up them melon slices, yo. I think this pretty much proves the theory it does have to be on, on dirt. And you know what? That's fine. Let me just kind of repair the damage here. Dirt. Man, I've already blown through most of the dirt that I picked up. So we've got sustainable, well, we have a sustainable food source in the form of this melon farm. And what I think I'll even end up doing is expanding it out to more. So 
because for a while until the auto wheat farm uh, picks up, uh, I'm going to have to probably do a lot of surviving off of melons. And you know what? That's fine. Uh, does it give a lot of hunger satiation? Not really, but does it prevent me from dying? Yeah, probably. Well, let me get some of this stuff lit up here. The last thing I need is, right now, is a zombie incursion. Although I, I do intend to build a... Although I do totally intend to build a mob farm at some point. Oh, that's going to require a lot of cobblestone. Got to be an easier way to do a mob farm. So let's grab that. 16 melon. I need another 12 seeds. No, oh, 13. Well, whatever. It's fine. I think these and this are done, ready to be harvested. Very nice. Five. One of these gave three? No, I hit one accidentally. It'll just my luck. Oh, hey! Where did that guy spawn from? Oh. Oh. Is that a spider jockey? Just a spider. Well, he's going to drown. That's fine. So I wasn't expecting this quite yet. Let those two kind of have it out here. I wasn't completely and emotionally ready for uh, spiders, per se. and my headset just decided that it wanted to update. How fun! Wow. For a second there, my headset was determined to update. What that is over there? There are lots of things in this world that I need to investigate. No, stop trying to update, you stupid headset. Always when I want to record, it wants to update. Right. I think that's looking pretty good so far. We got a little bit of a farm set up. We got uh, we got access to another shop. Uh, I do need to figure out wheat farming. I do need to figure out an auto wheat farm at some point. Because it looks like that's going to be our, our mainstay currency. There we go. Although I feel like the crops are growing insanely fast. One, two, three, four. Don't know what we're going to use the uh, pumpkins for, but we'll use them somewhere. Yeah, that looks real good. I'll grab a screenshot here. All right, but unfortunately, that is all the time we have for today. When we come back next time, hmm, what do we want to do next time? I know. Let's build us a, a little lean-to, a little house, uh, someplace to uh, kind of call our own here. Kind of shove all this stuff in here and deal with it later. Yeah, so next episode, when we come back, uh, we're going to go ahead. We're going to build ourselves a little house. I can show off my absolutely shitty building skills. And, uh, yeah, and then we'll take care of, like, the daily, uh, the daily stuff. All right. See you guys next time.